So part of me has always wanted to make more vlogs on this channel, but I've always been sort of saying to myself like, oh, what am I going to make vlogs about? And then it sort of occurs to me, how do I think that my life is not interesting enough to make vlogs? I mean, okay, so let's, let's just set the scene right now. I am currently in the United States after having been to four different American cities and having done quite a bit in each of them. And somehow that makes me think that I just don't have anything to talk about. Okay, well, let's just, let's just solve that problem. So, um, yeah, I'm currently in Philadelphia right now. I'm sitting, uh, I'm staying with um, a friend because I have a really interesting living situation right now. I currently don't have anywhere to live um, in the UK or really anywhere because I always have this problem. This is always a thing that I just keep on having um, from time to time. It's just I end up having no home and I'm just homeless and then I have to be like hey friends can you just sort of lodge for me and then I end up flying out to the United States because that's the complete logical thing to do um I'm basically a couch surfer right now which is a pretty fun lifestyle honestly and um yeah I'm currently sitting in Philadelphia which um I, I would show you more but I'm currently sitting inside on a on a couch I would show you some of the wonderful America outside and all of that lovely freedom of which the air I am currently breathing um which what are we even talking about? Anyway, I was saying before about how I want to make more v regular vlogs like this, and honestly, I think I have enough to talk about, given what I was saying. So, so, so currently, I'm in um, Philadelphia. I've been here, I've been in this country for about a month now. I've been um, jumping across cities. I'm currently in Philadelphia. I was last in Baltimore, then I was in Columbus, and then I'm going backwards. Yeah, okay. Then I was in Columbus, I was in New York, and I actually, well, when I arrived in the UK, um, when I arrived in the UK, in the United States, I I arrived in Baltimore, so I've actually been to Baltimore twice on this trip right now, so that's that's just an interesting sort of uh, side point. But anyway, so um, I've been having a lot of fun. I've been uh, meeting a lot of people over here because obviously I'm staying with a whole bunch of friends and I've been having, um, I've been having a blast, honestly. I like this country and I like all of the stuff and honestly, I could stay here if I... If, no, 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 no I, I could just stay here. No, but I'm not going to do that. I, I do have a plans to go back to the UK eventually, but uh, this is what my this is what I've been uh, brought to right now, just sort of jumping across the states, and it's it, it's fun. Um, I was actually in Baltimore just this weekend. I was at a, a convention um, at uh, BronyCon because that's um, totally a thing that I was. Although I must say, like BronyCon was fun. I even got like this really cool bag with it. Look at all those ponies. Look at all of that. That is like beautiful um in fact this this whole BrodyCon incident is basically the thing that encouraged me to make this vlog here and the people who encouraged me to do this you know who you are and i very much hope that you take credit for that in the comments because like th this is probably going to start something because honestly um I i've had a lot to, like i have a lot to talk about i think uh right now i'm probably just going to focus on the events of this weekend because honestly i've had like an entire month of stuff going on right now incidentally i'd like to thank headache queen for this like really beautiful badge that uh, that steve is currently wearing isn't that adorable it's got like googly eyes on it and everything it's like it's just i, I feel so happy about that so thank you so much for that that makes me very happy and steve is very happy too just look at his face that is that is the happy face coming from Steve. Anyways, that weekend was kind of funny because I didn't actually intend to go to Baltimore or BrodyCon that weekend, but uh, basically changed my mind on that last minute. I didn't even know it was a thing, in fact, um, but <laughs> I ended up... Um, so, side story, I, I probably need to go backwards on this. I really should not be starting on the events of this weekend, but you know what? That's what this vlog is going to be. Um, so, I was actually at the Pokemon US Nationals, which will probably be the topic of another uh, video when I get around that to that, because honestly, I'm probably going to upload a whole bunch of uh, Pokemon Battle videos from that anyways, or at least one or two. Uh, but anyways, I was at the Pokemon US Nationals in Columbus, Ohio, and um, I was on my way back, and by back, I mean I was on my way towards Philadelphia, because I hadn't actually been to Philadelphia yet. Um, um, as I said before, sofa surfing across a whole bunch of people. I was actually uh, originally in New York, um, staying with someone there, and then I was going to come back in this direction, but towards Philadelphia, where I was going to stay with that person. But anyways, um, when I got on the bus in Columbus, um, I actually ended up um, chatting with this one girl, because I was I um, got on the bus and I ended up sitting next to this girl who ended up being like some um, really cool, like... Um, world traveler person who was like sponsored to attend a bunch of events uh, from Italy which actually kind of resonated with me because I am a 
kind of cool world traveller who gets sponsored by a third party to attend events in from the United Kingdom. <laughs> so that was a very convenient seating arrangement. But I ended up talking to her, like... All evening, like, we were up until about 6am, and she was showing me all of this, like, My Little Pony stuff and whatnot. I mean, I, I, I'd i already been, like, in touch with all the Brony stuff before, so I did, didn't know what, what any of it was. In fact, I'd watched through quite a bit of My Little Pony before, but she basically convinced me to come off to the, um, to, to the convention, um, in, that was that, uh, which, which was the next weekend. So, <laughs> me being me, and stupid and impossible and all that was basically like okay so um got off at my stop in philadelphia and then just sort of immediately booked myself another bus off to baltimore to start going to then and in the meantime i was posting to my uh to my tumblr and to my twitter i was like so does anyone live in baltimore that i could just sort of crash with while i'm there which is always the the best way to uh, sort of. I did find someone, which um is is, is a good sort of thing, but just sort of uh, that diverted my plan slightly. Um, but it was worth it, honestly. Like I had, I got a really good kick out of it. Um, some of it was actually um actually got me encouraged to do quite a lot of things, including making this current video, which might actually spark me making more vlogs in the future. I met some really cool people, including the one who gave me this for Steve, the little badge, which um and also so, j just some other sort of stuff. I, I ended up meeting with a few of the people who actually like followed me on Twitter or Tumblr or even my YouTube, which again was another reason. Like actually, yeah, no, I met one guy who was just sort of like um I watch all of your YouTube videos and whatnot you should go back to that and i was just i just felt really bad i felt like i feel like i'm letting all of these people down so i gotta i gotta do this now i, gotta, I just, just gotta keep going also another consistent theme among the people i bumped into who knew me was the question why are you in this country which um is always an amusing thing in fact i think my favorite one was from uh, from headache queen who was just sort of like i'm kind of surprised to see you here but I'm also not surprised, which I thought was hilarious, because that basically sums up, like, what one would expect from me, given uh, all of the amount of travelling that I end up doing nowadays. That's basically the story of this weekend. I got peer pressured into making a video. Um, well, no, I'm, actually, no, to be fair, this entire weekend is basically the story of peer pressure. I was just sort of get on a bus, talk to someone, and so I'm like, oh, you should come down to BronyCon. And I'm just like, oh, fine, whatever, I, I, I'll do that. And then, of course, um, get there and then start meeting people who uh, end up liking all of my stuff. I'm just like, well, you should start making more videos. And then I start doing this, and it's just like, ah, well, that's, that's a thing. Um... But yeah, no, I have more stories from like the rest of this stuff. That one was just sort of a short little um, thing. Not the most interesting thing that I've experienced over the de uh, over the last few weeks, but definitely something. Um, yeah, and I guess I'll see you guys when I make a video in probably like I don't know a few days because I'm I'm I'll do this. I will do this. I swear to God. <laughs> Thanks for putting up my rambles i don't even know what i'm talking about this is like i'm, I'm just record i've just been recording for like 16 minutes so far and i'm gonna dread like mashing this together well see you guys bye